Jesus loves you, and he knows exactly how you feel. Hey guys, it's me again, Douglas, and today I wanted to make sure that you know something very, very important, and that is that you matter. And I know that it doesn't always feel that way, but it's true. And there are a lot of people out there who are going through some really hard stuff. And maybe you feel lonely. Maybe you feel scared. Maybe you feel like nobody understands you. You might be going through some really hard stuff that I could never really understand. And today, I wanted to talk to you guys about something that I haven't really, I haven't really brought up before because it's, kind of, it's kind of hard for me to talk about. And I'm not sharing something from my life because I'm trying to say that, that the stuff that I'm going through is harder than the stuff that you're going through. Because the truth is, I don't know what you're going through. I know that there's a lot of people who are going through a lot harder stuff than I am. I, I honestly, I've got a really good life. But there is this one thing that is hard for me. You know, a lot of people, they'll, they'll come, if I meet them, they'll, they'll ask me, they'll say, Hey, Douglas, are you like a turtle or something? Or are you a dinosaur? And most of the time when people ask me that, I just you know, laugh it off and say, oh, I'm just Douglas. But the truth is, I don't, I don't actually know. I don't know what I am. I really am just Douglas. I don't even look like my parents. This one time I met somebody who was green and he had red hair, but but he still didn't really look like me because he was all fuzzy and stuff. And sometimes it feels like nobody really understands me. You know, like I've got friends. I've got really good friends and I've got a great family and stuff, but I just feel like I'm alone sometimes. And I think, I think we all feel that way. Again, some of us have it harder than others, but I think that, I think that deep down inside we all feel lonely. And we all wonder if we matter. We end up looking around hoping that somebody will come along and tell us that we matter. Well, let me just set the record straight. You matter, okay? You matter to me, and most importantly, you matter to God. I know that I matter because my Creator loves me, and it's the exact same for you. You matter because your Creator loves you. Jesus Christ loves you so, so much. And you might feel like nobody understands you, and the truth is nobody does but God. God is the only one who really, really gets you, and he really, really does. He knows your heart, and he loves you. It doesn't matter what you look like. It doesn't matter what you are able to do or not do. It doesn't matter where you live. It doesn't matter who you're related to. It doesn't matter how smart you are or how rich you are or how poor you are. God loves you. You matter. And it doesn't matter who you are, where you are, or even, even what you are. God loves you. You matter. And I hope you know that today because it's important. And you don't need other people to tell you that you matter in order for you to matter. Okay? You might feel like nobody cares about you, but that's never true because God does. It still hurts if we feel like nobody loves us but God. If we feel like nobody cares about us but God. And so my challenge to you guys today is, is not just that you would understand that you matter, because that is super important. But my challenge today is that you would find someone who feels like nobody sees them. Someone who feels that they don't matter. And let them know that they do. Let them know that they matter to you, and most importantly, that they matter to God. You matter, and so do they. And as Christians, we need to share the love of Jesus Christ with everybody. First, we need to understand that God cares about us. We matter to God but we sure need to make sure that other people also know that they matter. God made you, and he knows you, and he loves you so, so much. You matter. <laughs>